This is just a short video showing Ubuntu GNOME uh, 15.10 running on a Samsung ATIF 700T uh, tablet uh, Ultrabook and hit the power Did we hit the power? There we go. Right. As you can see, uh, Grub Bootloader. And Splash. There we go. That's the login. We log in. I'm going to turn away as I type the password. Okay, and hit sign in. I've shown this before, uh, just wanted to make a new video of it uh, since uh, there we go. Now we have it in portrait mode. And Activities. And we can go to, uh, let's see, you get the on screen keyboard. I use onboard as the on screen keyboard. Let's go to Google News. There we go. This is the tablet ultrabook, and uh, as you can see here, it's the back. A bunch of stickers on the back, <laughs> and uh, I have it linked up with the keyboard. So here, and uh, yeah, so the scrolling works. Um, it's full desktop functionality. I have the uh, accessibility set to, uh, let's see, large. Oh, I don't have large text turned on. I can turn that on. Uh, the text adjusts with the large text. It's a little bit more readable in the tablet mode. It's a 1920 by 1080 screen. 4 gigabyte RAM. Uh, it is a Core i5 processor. So um, full PC compatibility. And uh, so there you have it. I figured I would post this again uh, since the new uh, BQ Aquarius M10 Ubuntu tablet came out. And uh, just showing that you can make your own Ubuntu tablet uh, if you just add uh, a couple of the right apps. And I have these scripts here. Uh, which I borrowed from elsewhere, uh, so I can rotate uh, left, which I have for portrait, or I can put it in normal. As you see here, and uh, you know this can be docked uh, if you use the. Uh, micro HDMI port on the side so so yes you can buy the Ubuntu uh, tablet the official one uh, now or uh, pre-order it rather or you can make your own from a refurb machine which is what I did this is a refurb uh, ultrabook so and I got it cheap and there you have it